All right, what's up, guys? Today I'm making a quick video on my newest air gun I just got today. It's the Artemis PP750 in 22 cal. I got it from uh, Crail, which is in the Netherlands, and it took four days to get here to the U.S. during this uh, coronavirus deal. So that's pretty damn good. But anyways, my girlfriend actually got me this as a gift. And it's pretty damn cool. It's uh right now I have the single shot tray in. It's a pistol, but it has this adjustable stock. And as you can see, this is the length I have it. But that's not the length it comes. I uh Used a Dremel on mine just to make it a little bit shorter. This is the length of pull that it comes with, like that. And for this uh, Leapers Bug Buster scope, that's a little bit too long. To adjust it, there's two brass buttons. You just push them both and then slide it. It's uh, fully shrouded. It's a little bit loud, but not too much. I would say it's about as loud as a Umarex Gauntlet or a Marauder Pistol. It's a side lever. I'll show you. I'll show you here how it functions. So functions like that. As I said, I have the single shot tray in right now. So I'll get a shot over here and slide it out. It also comes with a seven shot mag. There's a little magnet in there and one on here. And the magazine in the single shot tray both have the magnet. They just snap in like that. But the fill probe is right there. And I've been pumping it up to 30 bar, which is actually extremely easy with a hand pump, which is why I wanted this gun. I wanted it for a uh, squirrel gun with the dog when I'm squirrel hunting with a dog in an area where you're not allowed to shoot a regular firearm like uh, city areas and stuff shooting pigeons stuff like that the safety I don't know if all the Artemises are like this or just this one but the safety is on the trigger and it's on the left side so right now it's on safe it's on safe and you have to push it out. I'll go ahead and shoot it once just so you can see the noise uh, level. It's not uh, loaded right now, so. And that's how loud it is. The, stop, the butt plate is adjustable. It slides up and down. And yeah, that's pretty much it. It's a neat, neat little gun. It comes with this fill probe here. And then I'll also open the box to show you everything it comes with. Oh. Open the box, it comes with the owner's manual. And it comes with this bag with some extra seals. And uh, this steel cover, which I don't know what it's for. It's got two holes in it. Don't know what that's for. Comes with a mag. Like I said, it's a uh, seven shot mag. I'm not using it right now because with this, these rings I have on the scope, it won't fit. I need to get higher rings. I just threw on a scope I already had. It's the UTG Bug Buster 
uh, three by nine with an adjustable objective. It comes with iron sights. I took mine off so I could put the scope on. As you can see, they're kind of basic. Not that crazy. They're adjustable though, so kind of reminds me of a Crossman, uh, like a thirteen seventy seven or something like that. I like the sights on that. Came with that, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I know there's not. I try to watch reviews on this, and there's not a lot of reviews that are in English. So I figured I would show you guys. There, there's a few in English from the UK, but the American version is a little bit different. It's a little bit more powerful. It's shooting around 12 foot pounds of energy, anywhere from 605 to 650 feet a second. With uh, I was shooting 14.3 grain Crossmans, and then I was shooting 18 grain uh, JSB Diablo Exact Heavies. I think that's what they're called. Hold on, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and grab them real quick. So yeah, exact jumbo heavy, and these are 18.3 grains. But my grouping at 30 yards, maybe a little more, maybe about 35, is this. And this is a seven shot group, which is not bad considering one pellet is, uh, let me show you, one pellet's about that big. So if that was a squirrel, you know, I'd be dead every shot, especially aim at the head, except maybe that one. So, yeah, but I've only had this gun for one day, so I can't tell you much about it, but I can say I like it so far. I had a Marauder uh, pistol. I have another video on that. I don't know if I actually made a video on it or if I just mentioned it in a video, but uh, I think I, I think I like showed it in one video trying to sell it or something, but this seems around the same power level as a Mar marauder pistol and it seems a little bit more accurate for me you know out of the box the marauder pistol you can do a lot of stuff with it but out of the box this seems a little more accurate and a little more powerful it, it could be on par with it but you know they're they're around the same power level and this this just feels a lot more solid and this has a regulator too so i get about about 35 40 shots before it falls off the regulator so that's also cool but yeah i'm not really a reviewer just figured if any of you guys are thinking about buying one of these and you can't get any info in my opinion they're pretty damn good for the price especially so I'm gonna make more videos of, of this in the future hunting videos so stay tuned and if you have any questions on this gun you know go ahead and ask me all right thanks for watching later